Hello everyone, my name is Isaac and today I'm super excited to be showing you my brand new website for 2025. So I recently did a complete redesign of my entire personal website and I thought I would show it with you all today. So before I show you my website, I want to first talk about my design philosophy when building this. So there are four things I've tried to keep in mind for this build with the first one being the website should be personal and fun. I'm sick and tired of seeing boring, boring personal websites that just looks all similar and uh, the same as each other, just like my previous website. So yeah, I'm uh, a big fan of finding sort of unique websites that show a bit of personality at least. So I've tried keeping this in the back of my mind when creating this one. I also want the website to be very low maintenance. So when a new build is deployed, it should just work. Things shouldn't be breaking and needing to be fixed all of the time. Uh, it should be cheap, which it is. I'm hosting it for free right now. And also it should be easily extensible. So if I want to add something new, it should be a very low barrier for me to go ahead and add it. And with that being said, let's go ahead and show you the website. Okay. Boom, Perfect. here it is. So uh, as you can see on the landing page, you are immediately bombarded with a bunch of different things. And that's sort of the theme for this site is that there should be links everywhere. So on the main uh, homepage, you can see a list of my latest posts and you can also see a list of my latest videos and also the latest photo I have posted. So <laughs> this is just a sample, um, I haven't really finished building out the photo section for the website but hopefully i can get that done uh, sometime soon okay so yeah that was the main page and i think because there are so many different things to click on this site i will just have to sort of go through this kind of quickly so clicking on a blog post takes you to the post itself so this is a pretty minimal page all of the posts looks like this and uh, yeah, uh, you have a link back to the main site and that's it. Next up, we have about. I have this uh, text section where I write a bit about myself and this website. And also I say hello and your IP. So I should actually blur this because this is my IP. And uh, yeah, I think it's just kind of fun to uh, show you your IP when you enter the website. And then I have an an ordered list of things I like uh, and uh, yeah that's basically it then we have the blog page where I again list all of the blog posts and I am planning on creating a custom tags page because I have a pretty uh, big list of tags on all of my blog posts so I need to get that fixed then we have the newsletter page which just uh, has a form for signing up to my newsletter and uh, yeah this also should be redesigned quite a bit then we have the photos page which i'm working on right now so uh, i will cover the tech stack later but here's a hint i use bunny for cdn and image storage and uh, yeah i can store some high quality images uh, for a penny and uh, nothing more so that's it then we have uh, my favorite page on this side probably which is the reading page and okay the image of me reading isn't working but fuck it i have this cool font and then i list out every single book i have read since 2022 i think and yeah i try to keep this list uh, updated and once i've read a book i uh, post it here and uh, I sometimes write a short review so this is in Norwegian but uh, yeah I think it's cool that you can click in on every single book uh, I have read and I also rate them so that's very cool then I have the code page and just like it says here I'm not really sure what I'm gonna put on this page but yeah I guess I will want to put some code on here and then we have the projects page so this is <laughs> also not uh, complete yet but uh, fuck it I have written a bit about my vinyl an old app I did but I want to create uh, actual pages and blog posts for each of all of these things sign page I have a brutalist sign uh, about something very special 
that I might post public sometime soon, I'm not sure. Then we have my links page and uh, right now I have only captured a couple of links that I want to share but uh, I can show you this for instance, Rotary on smartphone looks like this, maybe you can buy it and create your own phone. Then we have the support page where I show you where you can support me. I recommend you joining me on Patreon if you're watching this video. Also, I have this now page uh, that is last updated the 2nd of April. So uh, yeah, this is not true. I'm not no longer working at Oshonoiken. I got a new job um, and creating a bunch of YouTube videos. Yeah, I guess I am sort of doing that still. Uh, then we have my uses page where I want to list out all of the things I use tech-wise on a daily basis. Uh, got some stuff here. Then we have a kind of special page, the pin board, which is, uh, yeah, it looks like this. And uh, this is where I put random things I come across online. So am I gonna pin some more things here? Probably, maybe not, <laughs> we'll see. Then we have the friends page. I can recommend you check out my friend Nuti at nuti.no. Then we have the guest book, which is coming very soon. And um, yeah, uh, like I said in the previous video, I had the guest book live for a, a couple of hours, but my Discord channel griefed it. So uh, thanks Discord, but I will add a, an updated version with GitHub authentication soon. So you can all sign my website. And then we have a music page where I want to post some guitar demos. Then we have the colophon for this website. So how this website is built. And this is actually pretty cool as I've tried to create a 3D graph view, just like in Obsidian to show all of the pages on my website and the links between them. So this is the main page and this is an example for a blog post that apparently links to Okay, I guess the main page and uh, there's a page here, projects that has a bunch of backlinks and uh, yeah, it's not working uh, just like I intended to yet, but I think I'm onto something here and you can also click on stuff like this and uh, yeah, it doesn't work. Okay, fake it. Then we have the last page uh, on this site, which is the change log. So as you can see, if I scroll down, I started working on this page or I actually added this change log on the 2nd of April and uh, yeah, slowly but steadily add some more things here and there and uh, back to the design philosophy with the website being personal and fun and low maintenance. That's sort of why I've decided to push this out now, even though the website is nowhere near finished. So uh, I can recommend you doing the same. Just try to create something fun and make the internet a cooler place to browse around. I feel like the internet has become so boring and uh, shit lately. So yeah, do what you can and try to uh, create your own personal website. So yeah, hopefully you enjoyed this quick tour of my website. I just now decided that I want to split up the demo into two parts. So this is the uh, tour and in the next video I can do a bit more in-depth tech uh, analysis of the entire website. So if you are interested in that, uh, make sure to subscribe to the channel and that will be coming very soon. And also before I sign off, I want to give a huge thank you to brilliant.org for sponsoring this video. Building something like this requires a lot of different technical knowledge and if you're interested in learning the fundamentals of programming for yourself, Brilliant.org is a great place to do so. Brilliant offers a bunch of different interactive courses in topics like math, science, programming, data analysis and AI. For instance, if you want to learn Python and how to think like a programmer, they have great courses covering these topics. What I personally really like about Brilliant is how they break down complex programming concepts into small digestible lessons, making it perfect for both beginners and experienced programmers. If you want to try out Brilliant, head over to brilliant.org slash Isaac or you can scan the QR code on the screen to get a 30 day free trial. You will also get 20% off an annual premium subscription. The link is also in the description below. And again, thank you to Brilliant for sponsoring the channel.